Let's see. I am in. I am in already. Okay. Uh, checking microphone. Do you hear me? Hello. Hello. Good evening. Hi, teacher. Good evening. Hi, Salma. Good evening. Hello, Claudia. Elena. Okay. Good evening, teacher. Good evening. Welcome. Welcome back after a weekend. Uh, Mario, Rafael. Hello. Vanessa and Marce Hernandez. Hi, teacher. Hello, how is it going? What's up? What's going on? What's going on in your life? How is it going? Good, good. Normal. So, so. Okay. No big, no big deals. No big deals mean like everything is fine. Normal in my life. No ups and downs. Okay. Great. Okay, let's see who else is connecting. David Alberto, Elvira, okay, Gabriela. Ah, very Vanessa, Gabriela. Okay, welcome guys. How's it going? Great. How are you feeling today? Hey, I see someone, I see a little boy behind next to, okay, now he's next to, uh, is he your son, Elena? Is he, is he your son, Elena? Is he, is he your son? The boy, the boy, is he your son? Uh, and, yes, ah. he's my son. <laughs> yes, he is. Ah, okay, yes, how, old, how old is he? Uh, seven years. Ah, okay, okay, perfect. Okay, <laughs> good, good, seven. He is, he is, okay. He is, he, remember, oh, okay. he is, he, yes. Because in English, we need to use the complete, the complete structure. He is seven years old. Okay, what's his name? What's his name? His name is Dante Martinez. Ah, like Dante, like the, the book. Yeah. Okay, interesting. I have never had a name in a boy about him. Okay, but good. Okay, pretty Thank nice. You. Nice, okay. Uh, welcome guys, welcome. Welcome, what is the week that we are in? What is the week, week? The week? Four. Week four, imagine we reached, we reached the week number four and we say like, like the song, como la canción, Air Supply song. Uh -huh. Air Supply song. Do you know Air Supply? Do you listen to Air Supply's music? No. <gasps> no. Goodbye. Hey, come on, listen to music. Okay, Air Supply is very good. All music, but pretty nice. Pretty nice to practice English. Yes. Okay, great. We reached uh, um, week number four. Thursday, we finish and we say goodbye. Goodbye to the model three. Okay. Teacher, yo tengo una pregunta. Question, yes. Eh, después de que terminemos este, este módulo, usted ya no nos seguiría dando clases o sería otro, otro teacher. Okay, um, let's see. That is a question for administrative personnel. Okay, they can answer that. I can't, to be honest. <laughs> I can't answer that. No puedo contestar eso. Okay. Because I don't have control of the groups. No tengo control de los grupos. Okay, that is the thing. But you can, you can, you can ask, you can ask the personnel. Okay, puede consultar ahí. Ellos van a indicar. If you request, si solicita, okay, it's up, it's up to you. Es opción suya. Si solicita, I, I want the teacher to be the next, to be in the next level. But you can you can ask. The best way is that you can ask. Puede consultar. Oh, okay. Sorry, I stopped the class by mistake. Ooh, okay. Okay, so you can you can ask. Puede preguntar. You can ask. Uh oh, okay. I see Marcy says, okay. Um, oh, okay. I see that. Okay, but that is that is the thing, okay? But 
anyways, we can continue learning, okay, from other teachers. We can continue learning a lot of things. Okay, uh, guys, let me share you a video in this moment. I will share my monitor. Okay, do you see the picture? Yes? Yes, teacher. Okay, yes. picture on the screen. Okay, perfect. Let me show you this video. It's about three minutes and a half. Uh, almost, I uh, know, it's a five minutes, okay? But we're gonna watch it. Uh, your attention, please. I will play it only once, solo una vez, only once. Uh, but let me check something. Okay. El Insaforp ha trabajado con un alto nivel de profesionalismo, pensando siempre en incrementar las posibilidades de crecimiento para la gente de nuestro país. Nos hemos dedicado a que a través de la formación se generen oportunidades para los salvadoreños y así cada vez más, en un mundo más competitivo y globalizado, siempre existan en nuestro país posibilidades de superación para todos. Miles de hombres y mujeres han logrado desarrollarse profesionalmente y han ampliado sus conocimientos y posibilidades laborales a través de los diferentes programas de formación que son parte del Sistema de Formación Profesional, el cual ofrece programas de formación para todos los niveles de recurso humano dentro de una empresa. Se ha incrementado productividad de muchas industrias y cientos de empresas a través de la capacitación y formación de cientos de miles de salvadoreños con programas como Área Técnica, ofreciendo cursos técnicos para mejorar el desempeño operativo y tecnológico de los trabajadores. Competencias Gerenciales, con temas de capacitación para complementar y actualizar conocimientos para áreas de gerencia. Inglés para el Trabajo, contenidos estandarizados del inglés para hacer a los trabajadores más eficientes y productivos en el desempeño de sus funciones. Mejora de Competitividad de las MIPES. Amplios temas de capacitación, específicos para micro y pequeños empresarios. Cursos cerrados y abiertos, tratando temas de capacitación para trabajadores de las empresas cotizantes de Insaforp. Insaforp Online, cursos online con el horario y ubicación que más convenga al usuario para la constante capacitación en múltiples temas y profesiones. Además, el Insaforp también genera oportunidades para los jóvenes y los salvadoreños en condiciones de vulnerabilidad, ofreciendo para ellos cursos de formación inicial para que más salvadoreños puedan crecer y desarrollarse con programas como Hábil Técnico Permanente ofrece la enseñanza de técnicas y destrezas en diferentes oficios, complementando el conocimiento técnico con competencias blandas necesarias para desempeñar un trabajo. Empresa Centro es un exitoso programa que utiliza la modalidad de formación dual, ofreciendo carreras técnicas que combinan clases teóricas con prácticas en empresas con un alto porcentaje de empleabilidad. El proyecto Caminos de la Juventud forma a jóvenes en condiciones de vulnerabilidad que han finalizado el bachillerato, brindando formación vocacional, habilidades para el trabajo y emprendedurismo. Proyectos especiales. Los proyectos especiales son aquellas acciones de formación que incorporan a otros actores e integran elementos complementarios, como desarrollo humano, articulación con proyectos productivos, financiamiento de herramientas y equipo básico para el autoempleo. Trabajando con el compromiso claro de ayudar al desarrollo del país y con un equipo profesional entregado a buscar oportunidades para nuestra gente, es que Insafor ha logrado tener un modelo de gobernanza y gestión ejemplar que tiene como base el diálogo permanente entre el sector empleador, laboral y el gobierno, formando a los trabajadores, capacitando a la gente de nuestro país. Es que transformamos la vida de las familias salvadoreñas, porque en Insafor trabajamos todos los días sabiendo que, a través del conocimiento, es que estamos formando un mejor El Salvador. Okay, that was the end, okay? That was the video that was projected. Okay, let's go back with the class. Okay, could you hear the, the audio, yes? What did it have? 
Yes, teacher. Yes, yes okay. Teacher. Perfect, perfect. No problem then. Okay, let's go with the class. Okay, uh, let me see. Okay. Okay. Let me check. Okay, I am in the first slide. Okay, what class number is it? What class number? 13. Thir 13. 13. 13. The, ac the accent is... The accent is in teen, 13. Okay, perfect, class 13. Okay, we can pass that because you know it, that already. You know the indications. Okay, excellent. And the four areas that we have been practicing. Okay, question for you. Do you feel that you have improved uh, in this model? Do you feel that you have improved? in this model or that yes, you have teacher. learned? Uh, what, do, what do you have learned? Yes? yes. What, what have you learned in, in your opinion? What have you learned in this model? Speaking. Ah, okay, you're speaking. Okay, you're speaking. What else? I learned about the tools in I learned about uh, Macmillan dictionary. It is oh. very interesting. Okay, that's that's cool. Okay, yeah, the tools are for you to use. Okay, they are free to use, and you can explore it. Okay, not only uh, look look out looking up the words and, and that's it, and the pronunciation and grammar, etc. You have a lot of things in in that in that tool. Explore the tools. Go beyond again. Once say, yeah, explore. Okay, what else, Claudia Maria? Uh huh. What have you learned, Vanessa Gabriela? Something, I guess. Uh huh. Pronunciation. Pronunciation. Okay, in the reading activities, correct? Reading the, the some specific words, phrases, meanings, etc. Okay, great. Uh, keep on, keep on, and going that. Okay, keep on. Continue, keep on. Okay, those are the tools that you know. Okay, class, uh, this is like a review. Okay, and review and practice about the. Verb to be simple past. And simple past. Okay, verb to be in simple past. We have been practicing the past of the verb to be in simple past. Okay, for example, the question. Where were you where born? Were you born? Okay, where were you born? What type of question is that one? Is it open or a closed question? That is first, okay? Open. That we need to have an open. It's open question because we need the word. Where, WH where. question. WH question, perfect. Ah, okay, I see. See, you have learned something when you see WH, <laughs> uh -huh. when you see WH, that, that means that is open question you need to uh, gather or collect information from someone. Okay, in the answer, answer the question individually. Where were you born? Salma, Salma, in which city? Where were you born? Salma, Salma, Joanna, maybe the Hernandez, where were you born? I were, I were in San Salvador. Uh, was. Okay, uh -huh. was partially correct. Partially correct, parcialmente correct. <laughs> Why? I was. I was. Uh -huh. I, was. I was. Where were you born? Uh -huh. was, it's fine, it's fine. Yes, Vanessa, Gabriela Hernandez. Ah, Cojute de Chorizo City. Okay, uh, today I tasted uh pato chorizo de, de pato they are delicious yeah yeah they are they are delicious they are different but delicious okay great kohut yeah my family bought them there familia los compro okay great uh-huh uh, someone else uh, raised the hand 
someone else. Okay, and you, Mario, where were you born? In which part of El Salvador city, country? I was born in San Salvador. I in San Salvador, okay. And what about you, Samuel, Isaac? Isaac in English. Samuel, where were you born? Francisco, Daniel, Peñate, maybe? He's in class? No. Maybelline? Where were you born? Uh, I was born in San Miguel. San Miguel, okay. San Miguel City, Elena. Uh, I was born in San Salvador. Okay, San Salvador too, Claudia Maria. Yeah. I was born in San Salvador. In San Salvador, okay. Uh, Jocelyn, Elizabeth. Where Hi, teacher. You? I was born in Santa Ana. Santa Ana City, the cathedral is beautiful. Very, hey, is, re, is, the, is the cathedral being remodeling or rebuilt? No, teacher. No, they are, they are not repairing. Okay, people are not repairing the cathedral. Okay, and Gabriela Molina, where were you born? Hello, teacher. Hello. I was born is no, I was born in Acajutla. Acajutla, yeah. Acajutla is department. So teacher, you don't know, teacher. <laughs> Sometimes <laughs> I confuse. I I can say it. Okay, I confuse. Yeah. Celia del Carmen, where were you born? Hi, teacher. Hello. I was born in San Salvador. In San Salvador too. Okay, Elvira. I was in Salvador. I was, I was. I was born, perdón. Ah, okay, me. okay, no problem. Okay, mention, mention the complete structure because when you said that, you said, I was San Salvador, yo era San Salvador. Mm -hmm. Ah, but the verb is born, correct. Marcia Hernandez. Okay. Thank you, teacher. Okay, uh -huh. no problem. Uh, I was born in uh, San Salvador. San Salvador, okay. A lot of a lot of you are from San Salvador. Okay, great. Yeah, that is the answer. I was correct. Bird to be simple past. Okay, and that is our flag. Uh, okay, question. What is the question there? Can you make simple past question with verb? Verb with to verb? be. To be. And the answer for that question is. Mm -hmm. Identify, okay. Don't forget this. When you have questions, uh, don't answer mechanically. No contest them. Ah, yes, I do. Or yes, I am. No. Focus or check, check, check the question. Check the complete question. Hmm. Okay. And what is the answer? What is the answer for that question? Affirmative. Yes, can you... Yes, I can. Perfect. Can A negative. Uh -huh. Can you? Correct. Negative. And the negative part? The negative? No, I can't. No, I can't. But, but yes, you can. In the affirmative is better. Yes, you can. Okay. Check. Identify the verb in the question and you will be fine. You will answer with no problems. Okay. But first you need to check. Uh, the question, let's see, can you may, okay, no verb to be in the simple past, no do, no did, it has can. Okay, yes, I can, perfect. Let's see, one, two, three. Check, indication. Hey, you saw it already, you saw him. Check, check, check. check. Pronunciation, check. Uh huh. Check the next picture and make a question. Simple past with? To be and an answer for the question. Answer no is? No W, no W. Answer. Answer, yes, answer, like that. Specifically like that. Así, específicamente answer, okay? No W, W doesn't have sound. Okay, perfect. Uh, do you recognize the picture? Yes. 
Yes. Okay. Okay. According with the picture, what is the correct question? Who was something plus? Ah, uh, what? Ah, uh, but there is a problem in this in this one. What is the problem? Was who can team flats? Is that correct or incorrect? Incorrect. It who is correct. Can okay, the correct question is. Who were? Who were? Who was? Who was? Cantinflas. Why no where? Why isn't aware? Why? Por qué? Why? That is singular. Uh, because, because, remember, why question? The answer is because. Because. Aha, uh -huh, because. Aha, uh -huh, in Cantinflas, what is the subject for Cantinflas? Actor. The subject, the subject. Aha, uh -huh, the subject is? He was. He. Yeah, but but in that case, he is he was is correct. Next but one. the question the question says who was Cantinflas, and the answer is he was correct. Affirmative. We use oh. in the affirmative the subject he and then the verb to be in the simple. He was past. Mexican. He was was um, the article. Actor. Don't forget. Actor. Uh, Med comedian. Uh, okay, uh, actor, actor comedian. Yes, yeah, correct, correct. Okay, but the nationality? Mexican. Okay, Mexican, Mexican. actor, comedian, etc. Let's leave it in actor. That's it, simple. Okay, see? Who was? Was in the question, yes. Was in the question and was in the affirmative answer. This is affirmative and this is question now is correct okay perfect perfect uh next is that correct where were you born yes correct or incorrect where do you work uh, the opposite do i change it uh -huh. yes 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 what ck yes what where, 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 where do you work born? Uh -huh. question is that correct or no? Yeah. Yes, it is correct. Yeah. Okay, it's already there. Yes, I I don't need to do anything else. And the answer is? I was. Mm -hmm. I, I was born. born. What, is, what is the flag? In what Mexican is the flag? Was. Oh, in Mexico. Was born in the Salvador. Uh, okay, I was going to ask you where where you were were you born in mexico <laughs> mm -hmm. okay no it's okay it's okay okay no problem don't say i'm sorry no no problem we are learning we always learn and siempre aprendemos no worry so the correct answer is i was born in i was, el I was born in el salvador don't change don't change your country <laughs> Okay, don't change it. No lo cambia. Okay, Salvador is pretty cool. Isn't it? Uh -huh. Isn't it or no? Yes or no? Yes, it is. Pupusas, Atorchuco, Riguas, a lot of things. Okay. Uh, next one, let's see. Next, next. Uh, the next one is this one. Uh -huh. What happens here? Okay, according where, with the picture. Where? Okay. Okay. And the date, what is the date? Sunday. 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 24th. July 24th. July, Sunday, July. July. Ah, July. Okay. July, like this. July. Correct. But this is in grammar incorrect. Pronunciation correct. July? 24th. 24th. And that was yesterday. Yes. According with the calendar, was yesterday. Okay, and what is the correct question in simple past with the verb to be? Where, where, uh -huh. where, 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 yes, okay. uh -huh. yes okay. uh -huh. where, where, and in next? In the morning. 
Where you morning? Yesterday. Where you morning? No. Like this. No, yesterday. Where were you? Yesterday in the morning. Ah, okay. Yeah. That was. Esa era. Yesterday in the morning. And the answer is. Guys, you can answer any of you. Cualquiera. Any of you. Answer. I was. Uh, I was. In my bed. I was. Oh, okay, I was on. <laughs> is with a preposition on. Okay. Remember. Remember prepositions. When you are touching or when an object is touching a surface, it's on. Okay? No, in. You can say, I was in bed. Mm, it's possible too. Okay. I was, in bed. Mm -hmm. I was on my was. bed. Sleeping, I imagine. Yes, yes. Okay. Okay, perfect. You can mention any place. I was at the church, I was at the park, etc. Okay, this is the complete correct question. Yes, where were you? Can you read it one more time? One more time. Where? Where were you yesterday in the morning? Where were you? Okay, close or open question? Open question. Open. Uh -huh. WH. See, simple. WH. Okay, next. What about that? Look at the picture. Okay. Park. Look at the picture. Ah, that is a game park for children. Okay, it looks pretty nice. Okay. Thank you. Uh -huh. Okay. Question, correct question is? Okay. They were in the park. They in the park. were in the park. Okay, let's see. They were, oh, WW. They were in the park. Okay, correct or incorrect? Question for you. Incorrect. It is incorrect. Why? Why is that incorrect? Uh, huh? And you know, you know, you know. You know. Yeah. Sabe. You know. Uh -huh. Where were they in the park? Ah, okay. Where where is first? Okay, where is first? Okay, let's change it. Okay, where they in they. the park? Ah, okay, in questions. Okay, remember in questions, close or open. This one, esta. Close, close. close, correct. When you don't see WH, that means close question. Where you don't have any WH word. When you have the verb to be in simple past, that means that is close. And the affirmative answer is for the negative in this case, because look at the picture. Do you see children in the picture? No. Answer. Do you see no. children in okay. the picture? Well, no, no, I don't, no, I, well, I don't see it. Uh, no, I don't. Correct. No, I don't see people or children. Okay. And that means that the quest, the negative answer goes how? How does it go? Como va? No, they weren't. Correct. No, they weren't no weren't. they weren't okay weren't. no they weren't correct uh but in this one we don't mention we don't mention children because we are using they but we can say where the children uh, were the children in the park hmm? no the children no the children no they, you can use they in the answer, okay? Yep, you can use they, correct. Because we all, we are only changing the subject. Were they in the park? No, they weren't. No, no they weren't, okay? Close question, because we, we don't have WH. Verb to be in simple past in the question, verb to be in the answer. Okay, perfect. The next one and 
Okay, this one. Look at the picture. There is a picture. What is the correct question in this one? Okay, this is number five. Mm -hmm. He was. He was. He was. Uh, he was. No, was but when he... you say when you say he was, that is affirmative, and we need to make questions. He was. was he? Ah, okay. Was he? Yes, because he was is is affirmative. No affirmative. It's a question. Um, was he? Was he? What is next? He was... see. What is next? <laughs> Oh, uh, listen. Listen. Uh-huh. This one. Listen. Listening. Next. Uh, okay. The music with two. two. Next is two. Listening to. Uh -huh. Two. Okay. Music. Okay. Music. Uh -huh. What is next? With headphones. With the headphones. Okay, close or open question. In this one, close or open? Open. Close. Okay, close. someone said open and someone else said close. What is the correct close. one? Close or open? Close. Close. Open. Close. Close. Uh, close. close. See? No WH. I am not requesting more information in the question. According with this question, no. It's only yes or no. Okay, according with the picture, the answer is? Yes. Yes. Yes, he was. Yes, he was. Correct. Yes, he was. Okay. But one question. Can you transform this open question in an open question? How would it be? ¿Cómo sería? How would it be for convert or transform into an open question? Uh -huh. How could you transform it in an open or into an open question? Mm -hmm. Nope, no ideas. Remember, WH. WH. Uh -huh. Why? Why he was? Why? Correct. Okay. One one example can be why. And why? Next. He was. Why? Uh -huh. He was. Why he was? No. Why he was? Is question in affirmative. No. Why? Okay, this is the way, correct. This is the way. Was why? Sorry, why? Why? Uh -huh. Read complete it, read it complete. Why was he that? that? Why was he? Uh -huh. Question in negative, teacher. Excuse me? Question in negative. Uh no, no. In this case is correct. Okay. Why? Why was he listening to music with headphones? And the answer? Because. Because. He, uh -huh. Why he? Because he? He was like it. Because he was? Like it. I don't hear you. Like it. Okay. Can you, can you, okay. Can you? Like type? it. Yes. White, white head. Can you? I don't hear you clearly. Why was? Why? Okay. Ah, okay. Because he. Okay, because he likes them. Would be. Okay. Ah, okay. Because he likes them. Porque le gustan. Okay. Because he prefers. He prefers a headphone and no earphones. Okay. This is an earphone. The small ones, ear in ear, okay? And the headphones, they are on, okay? That it would be a reason why, okay? It is correct. Okay, perfect, perfect. Okay, let's check. 
Bird to be simple past. This is. This is. This, this is the complete structure of bird to be. Structure. Of the bird to be in the simple past. Okay. Let's rephrase the affirmative. The affirmative in the simple past verb to be is. Uh -huh. In affirmative, affirmative. Where was? No, no, affirmative, affirmative sentence. Um, okay, what is the subject? The first subject. The first subject is. The subject, subject, first subject. I. I. Affirmative. I, I was. Next, I, I was. was. I was. Continue. He was. Um, after, after he I was. was. No, he was if after. But I was. Next is. Uh -huh, this one, this one. You were. You were. Ah, you forgot. Video, you forgot. Next. He was. He was. Uh -huh. She was. She was. She was. was. It was. We were. You were. We were. We were. And we were. they were. And they, they were. were. Correct. They were. Okay. And that is the affirmative. See? Subject, verb to be in simple past. And the complement. That's it. Any complement. Good. In the negative, follow, I... follow the structure. Follow this, but in negative. Yes, I wasn't, you weren't, he wasn't, he wasn't, it wasn't, you weren't, you weren't, they weren't. Okay, perfect. That is in negative. See? You follow the same the same thing, the same rule. There it is. Ta -da -da, ta -da -da, ta -da -da. Okay. What happens in question? The structure. You, you the change. Word. You change the negative. Huh? Excuse what me. Can can I? Where I? Where I um, let's see, I was in affirmative. In negative is I wasn't. I was, was ah, I was. that means ah. uh -huh. you only change the position. Uh, was, I. was I correct? Was I was savvy? No, was savvy? No, was savvy is for sushi. <laughs> was I okay? Was I was I estuve yo o yo era okay? Remember the meaning next. Where, where you? Where you? Where okay. Where you? Was one. Was he? You only switch was position. That's he. it. Was huh? she? Was she? Was it? Was it? Okay. Question. Correct. Next. Were you? Hmm? Were we? Were they? Were they? Okay. Very good. Were we in class yesterday, guys? Were we in class? Were we yes. in class? <gasps> Yesterday. Sunday. Were we? Were we in class? Yesterday? No, we weren't. No, we weren't. No, correct. Ah, okay, correct. Yes, no. Repeat we it, repeat it. No, no, no. we, we. we. Weren't. No, we weren't. We weren't. Correct. No, we weren't. Okay, very good. Okay, excellent. That's it. And finally, were they? Were they? Correct. In the were question. They? In the question. Yes. See. Was I? Were you? Okay, guys. If you repeat this consecutively. Okay, don't memorize. Sometimes memorizing things uh, don't work. Better is practice, repeating. I was, you were, he was, and making sentences, okay? Doing exercises and listening audios and so on. Repeating, repeat it several times and you will see, okay? And this is the complete structure of the verb to be in simple past, okay? Question, what is the question there? Answer simple past question with there to be. And the affirmative answer is? Thank affirmative. 
Yes, I know. I know you know. Yo sé que usted sabe. Huh? I know yes. you know. Yes, I can. Yes, I can. Yeah, because that is the verb that the question has. Okay, perfect. I will copy this link. I will copy the link and let's do a practice. Let's do a practice. Okay, I will close this. Okay, what is what is the game about? Open, open, open the box. Open the box. Very, 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 Okay, in below it says. Or negative. Okay. Okay. Can be or okay. Now, but you know the difference, okay? We have been practicing with open, with closed questions, and you know, you know that already. Okay, great. Let's begin. Okay, we have 10 boxes in the screen, on the screen. Let's see. Uh, ta, cha, cha, cha. Let's see. Uh, jo Jonathan. Hello, Jonathan. Are you in class? Yes. Jonathan one, Jonathan two, Jonathan three. Elvira. Hello. Elvira is not in class neither. Celia del Carmen. Select a number, please. Which number? Four. Or, okay, Celia, you will read the question for your classmates. And guys, you can answer the question if you know the answer. Or, what is the question, Celia? Yes, read the question, please. Read it. Uh, this one, just read it. No, just read the question. Just read it. Solo lea. Just read it. Where, where, where are you born? Where were you born, guys? And the answer is? I was born. I was born. In El Salvador. In El Salvador. El okay. Salvador. Great. I was. Correct. I was born. Okay. Perfect. Okay. Let me ask uh, someone else. Uh, Blanca. Hello, Blanca. Are you in class? Do you have a microphone? Yes? No? Ah, uh, come on. Christian, Christian, Isaac. Hey, we have two Isaac. Christian, are you in class? Yes? No? Yeah. Uh, okay. Okay, Christian, which number? Uh, six. Number six. Okay, read the question for your classmates, please. Mm -hmm. Okay, read, read the question. Read it loudly. Lea el voz alta, please. Where were you yesterday in the morning? Uh, okay, where were you guys yesterday in the morning? Where were you? In which place? Answer, answer the question. Where were you? I was in welding class. I was. Okay. Uh huh. Correct. What else? Yes. I was in the church. Ah, you were. Ah, okay. See how it changes. You were at church, David. Okay. Vanessa, Gabriela, and you. I was visit in the park. The oh, familia. we have a problem with the sentence in that one. What happens? Okay, let's che let's check. I was visit my family. You said right. Okay, but let's leave it like that. What happens this in this part? What happens? ¿Qué pasa aquí? What happens? Okay. Was was is water. What is water? What is water? Uh -huh. Agua. Okay, Ow. the verb to be is water, and this verb, visit, is oil. What is oil? 
Aceite. Aceite. Uh, okay, can you can you mix can you mix water and oil together? No. No. Impossible. Okay. That cannot be. No puede ser. Okay. So you need the verb to be only, not other verbs. Okay. No water, water and oil, they cannot be together. So I delete, I eliminate this verb. Ah, okay, what about this? Can you read it, please? I was, I was I, with my family. Ah, okay, what about, is that, this is the sentence correct in this opportunity? What do you think, correct or incorrect? Mm -hmm. uh -huh. mm, incorrect, because it's not a place. Uh, but according, but according with the sentence that doesn't have visit anymore. Yeah. Mm -hmm. The sentence is correct. Okay, I was with my family. You don't have visit. Okay, because remember, water and oil, no. Uh -huh. The sentence is correct. I was with my family at... At... The... At the... the at park. the park. Okay. The but both. Hmm? Correct. But in this case, now is correct. Okay, you don't have any other verb more than the verb to be in simple past. Okay, guys, is this example clear that you cannot mix verb to be in other verbs? Clear? Yes. 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 Ah, okay, okay, good. Mm -hmm. Okay. Can you try to translate that? Can you translate that in, into Spanish? No se puede. Oh. Uh, it's possible, but it's not correct and it doesn't sound good. Sí se puede, pero no suena bien y no, es, y no, suena, y no está bien. In, into Spanish, how would it be? ¿Cómo sería en Spanish this? Yo estaba visitando yo no con mi familia. Ah, uh, okay. I was visiting. Yo estuve visitando. Es uh, correct. I was visiting. Familia, pero no es. No, it doesn't have ing. No tiene ing. So, entonces. Yes. Yo estuve visito. Yo estuve visito. Yo estuve visito con mi familia en el parque. Is that correct? No. 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 What about if if I delete visit? Is it is it borrow visit? visit? Como se le? How do you read it? Huh? How do you? Estuve con mi familia en el parque. I was yo. Aha, correct. Okay. What about if I delete once and I place visit? Y pongo visit. Aha. And that, can you translate it? Can you Yo translate it? Visité a mi familia. Uh, visité, uh, but the verb, the verb is in simple present. It doesn't say visité, no dice visité. It's present, normal. Yo? Visito a mi familia. Visito a mi familia. Ah, okay. That is the thing where you only use, or the verb to be only, or delete the verb to be, and use this verb. Because this is the simple present tense. Simple present tense. Yes, el tiempo. Simple present tense. Do you see the verb to be in the simple present tense? No. No, right? You don't need the verb to be because it is the simple present. Yo visito mi familia. You don't need the verb to be. Aha. That is the, that is the thing. Si solo se usa el verb to be, or si se usa other verbs, si usa otro verbo. But together, no, because it doesn't sound good and it's not correct. Okay? Okay. Yes. yes? Sure. Okay. Sure. Porque el verbo to be es yo fui o, o, o estuve. Yes. In past. 
But in this case, it's simple present. Puede decir, I visit my family and it's correct. Yo visito a mi familia. Okay. Is it better the explanation in this case? Está mejor esta explicación? Yes, thanks. Okay. Okay, perfect. The thing is that you that you understand this part. Don't mix verb to be and other verbs because no, it cannot be. No se puede. No, no, no. Okay, perfect, perfect. Great. Uh, next, we have nine minutes. <gasps> nine minutes. Okay, next number. Next number, next number. Any, eight. any of you? Hey, number eight, eight. What is the question? Who was your best cow? Co-worker in your previous job. Previous, previous, repeat previous, previous. 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 Okay, who was your best co-worker in your previous job? Salma. Gabriela Molina. Francisco Daniel. <laughs> Elena. Aha. Eh, teacher, I don't remember eh, el significado de coworker. Guys, do you know the meaning of coworker? What is coworker? Classmate is we are you are classmates among yes. you. Coworker, a job. A ah, job. Compañero de trabajo. Correct, uh -huh. yes. Okay, okay. correct. Uh -huh. um, let me see. Um, but, but remember, subject, verb, complement, the complete structure in English. My best co worker in my previous job is his name. No, his, yes, his name is, um, is Enrique. Uh, okay, but we are not using verb to be in simple present. Is? Was. Correct. My best co-worker, and you were doing great. Estaba, yes. estaba bien hasta que llegó a previous job, and then was, y luego era was, by the way. Okay, with the job was, was, was name, or was only the number? Was the name, the name only, solo el nombre. Uh, was name. Enrique. Era Enrique, okay, was. Uh -huh. Okay, you don't need his. No necesita okay. his because... It's not necessary. Okay, okay, perfect, perfect. Next number, next number. And one. Uh, one, one, one. What is the question, number one? Guys, what is the question? Read it. You can read it. Where did huh? you sick last week? Uh, where you sick last week? Close or open? Question. Open. Okay. Open question, why? Why is it open? Why don't you Ah, because, ah, okay, you are looking at the word only. Solo está viendo la word. But look at the complete the question. Is that correct, the question? Is it correct? No. Okay, it's no. not correct. It's not. It isn't. Okay. What do I do to make it correct? To correct it. Para corregirle, ¿qué hago? What do I do? Uh, where? I, where? I delete. Where, I, where delete I delete this letter only. I delete the letter. What is the H. letter? H. H. The letter H. I H. delete it and now it's correct. Because I am not asking a place. I am asking about a state. So uh, preguntando de un estado. Health state, do you remember the topic? Health state. Yes, in previous classes. Okay. With no with no H, were you Close. sick last week? Close or open? Close. Ah, okay. That this time is closed. Close question. Okay. And the answer is Were you sick where? last week? Uh, were you sick last week? And the answer, the answer is. No, I Two options. No, I wasn't. Correct. In negative mm -hmm. or in affirmative is. No, I wasn't. Yes, I was. Yes, or, I was. Yes, I was in affirmative. Correct. Okay. Cool. Uh, next, next, next number. Next number. Four minutes. Three, three, three. 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 Question number three. Uh huh. 
was it Sunday yesterday? Was it Sunday yesterday according with the calendar? Was it Sunday yesterday? Yes, it was. Yes, it was. Correct. Yes, that is the was. answer. Yes, it was. Okay, next. This next. Uh, I, I heard two. Okay, I will open two. Uh -huh. How were you in 2020? Is the question correct? Is it correct? The question? Yes or no? Incorrect. Question. It is incorrect. incorrect. Uh -huh. It is incorrect. Again, right? No, no H. Yeah. No H. Okay. No. Okay. With no H, how old were you in the 2020? And the answer, the answer, guys, you can answer any of you. I was 28. I was 28, etc. Yes. Okay. Mm -hmm. Pretty yes. good. Okay. Excellent. Okay. Hey, only Elena is. And Joanna are answering the questions. No. Okay. Let's practice. Okay. Next, next. Three minutes. Three minutes for ten. Ten, ten, ten. ten number ten. Okay. A longer question. Which soccer team was this? <laughs> okay. What about that? That question. Do you know the answer? Do you know the answer? Which soccer team was the winner in the previous Champions League? For the ones yeah. who like football. Uh -huh. Yes, uh -huh. And the answer? Who knows? Yeah. Who knows the answer? Yeah. No. <laughs> hey, 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 hey. No answer. Okay. No, no. Subject verb complement. How do you begin with the with the answer? Como comienza with the answer? Which team? No, the, that is the question. I mean the answer. The answer. Which, the, answer. the team. The team. The team that was, was the winner. The winner in the Premier League. 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 Was, was Liverpool, I think. Uh, I no, I don't remember. No, Real Madrid. Madrid. Ah, yes. <laughs> yes. Uh -huh. Okay, but you were, you had an idea. Okay. 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 Cool. Okay. They played against Liverpool. They play against. Where in contra? Okay. Uh, next, next. Let's finish the numbers. Nine. 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 Okay. Was your teacher sleepy at 11 oh. o'clock affirmative. last night? Affirmative answer? Yes, he was. Okay, very good. Was your teacher third person? The question is asking about the third person. Was your teacher? Uh -huh. Uh -huh. So the answer is? Yes. Yes, he was yes he was simple simple okay next 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 seven seven okay seven who was mm -hmm. contemplat okay uh okay no problem elvira no problem okay yeah I, it's raining here too uh -huh. it was a, it was <laughs> He was an actor, a Mexican actor, etc. And yes, he was an actor. Cool. And number five, the final question is: Was your father at home last night? Was your father at home last night? Answer. Celia del Carmen, was your father? You can invent. You can invent. Okay. Close, close or, or open question. Close, close. or close, close question. Behind the close question in negative. No, he wasn't. Correct. Affirmative. Okay, no problem. Affirmative is? Yes, he was. Yes, he was. Okay, great. Perfect, perfect.
Okay. You answer the all the questions. Okay, guys. What you need to do is this only practice the structures. See, affirmative, negative, and question, and the short answers. That's it. Okay, it's only practice. You know already this. Ya sabe, okay? It's only practice. Okay, uh, see you tomorrow at nine o'clock. It's already 10 and one. Uh, thank you. Thank you for connecting to the class. See you tomorrow, Tuesday. Thank you, teacher. See you, Good see night. you. My pleasure. My pleasure. My pleasure. Go and rest. Have a great night. See you, see you. Bye-bye. Good night. Bye -bye. Good night. Good night. Thank you. Thank you, teacher. Good Thank night. Thank you a lot. Thank you a lot. Have a great night. Bye-bye.